is Lee Sterling of ParamountSports.com and I'm going to break down in this video the preview for the 2016 Clemson Tigers. Now, before I give you that preview of their season, just want to give you an idea of what's going on at Paramount Sports for this year. This will be our 25th season in business. We've had an incredible, documented 24 straight winning years in college and pro football. No one can match that record. How do we do it? I attend 15 to 20 spring games every year. My background is a former quarterback, uh, and then also having a background in finance with numbers. I'm able to use those numbers and use my expertise as a quarterback and how one team's strength will attack another's weakness. No one in the country has that expertise and can outwork me. So if you want to get the games that win, like I said, I've had 24 straight documented winning seasons. I rate my games from 10 to 50 units. My 40 to 50 unit plays, 28 and 4 over the last seven years. No one can touch that record. How can you get the entire season for just $1,597? You go to ParamountSports.com where it says Purchase Picks. Click on there. Just $1,597 over the Internet. Or you can order through our office, 800 400 9741. Now, on to this 2016 preview for the Clemson Tigers that came one play away from winning it all last year over Alabama and having their second national title, recent memory. They were going to be able to add to that 81 title, but it just was not meant to be. They were that close. Why were they that close? They had the best quarterback in the country. Number four, Deshaun Watson. Did everything. Passing, throwing. He was a leader. You saw when he was healthy. Best player in college football. Why didn't they win the national title? Gave up too many big plays. Just gave up too many long passes and runs and busts. Just, just, just you can't do that in a big game against a top opponent like Alabama. So they need to fix that. They've got to fix and they've got to plug some holes on defense. Only four returning starters. So they had a lot of guys get a lot of experience last year on defense. But they need some guys to step up, continue to pressure on the quarterback, and, and like I said, not have those busts and big game and coverage on the back end. Offense should be incredible. Tabo Sweeney's going to love this offense again because Watson returns, and you saw what he can do when he stays healthy. He's the best. Running back Wayne Gallman got better as the season progressed, and in the spring he looked incredible. He's one of the top running backs in the country. And then receiver, Artavis Scott, he is a weapon catching the ball and also in the return game. I don't think any team in the country has a quarterback, running back, wide receiver combo like Clemson has. They do need, though, to plug some holes on the offensive line. Lost four returning offensive line starters. I think they'll be okay, but not, obviously, as good as last year. The offense will score maybe the same, but they're not going to be the team that can run the ball down your throats uh, they'll have to throw the ball more and use, like I said, these great weapons, Watson, Gallman, and Scott. So I love this team. I think they're going to win the ACC. I think they're going to be in the mix for the national title. Will they win it? Probably not. I like LSU a little more. If you ask me before the season, they're probably in the top three or top four, but they're as good as anyone. Love Clemson. think they're going to be right there again with a few breaks they can win it, but... Uh, if I had to project before the year, they'll make it to the playoff, maybe lose uh, in the first and the semifinal game uh, this year. So, love Clemson. Think they'll be great again. You want to get involved with Paramount Sports and start winning this season? ParamountSports.com or 800-400-9741.